So I met this guy and I love him so much. But something does not just feel right. Okay. Pastor endorses him and everybody wants me to marry him, but I just don't feel okay mm. about this. Check him out. Yeah, it's cute, it's like he's a fine guy. But, but then why are you holding this picture? Ha. Huh. So I can find a prophet that will tell me if he's the one or not. <laughs> Sorry. You're laughing. <laughs> this is not a joke. Oh. You see this picture? I have used it to visit three different churches from one <laughs> program to the other, lifting it up. <laughs> My God, I mean, I can't feel love. Sorry. <laughs> the brain is so funny, honestly. See, listen. Have you not tried going to all these fake prophets in the past? Remember now, they dupe you. They even lied to you. They took advantage of you. You know they learn, honestly. What, what will I now do? Listen, listen. Be the prophet over your life. When you dwell in the secret place of the Most High God, He reveals secrets about the guy you want to marry. About anybody. I'm telling you, all you need to do is just be still. When your spirit is calm, when your spirit is still in his presence, you would know a lot from God. You will hear from him. It's simple. Oh, my friend, what is your talk now? How will I make my spirit still? Which one is still and, and busy? What do you mean? <laughs> listen, listen. See, if you want your spirit to be still, just lock yourself in a quiet place. I mean, your quiet room. Stay away from every form of distraction. Shut down every voice in your head. Your pastor, your brain, anybody. Just shut down their voice. Play songs, nice Christian songs. Take your Bible, read. I mean, it, it will just quieten your spirit. Before you know it, you would hear from God. I'm telling you. Yourself, you want to be busy, so this is an opportunity for you to do retreats. Retreats, there's no way God will not speak to you. You need it, it's about time. Inquire from God by the laws of spiritual intelligence. So, in your work with God, you will notice you'll be praying, you'll be praying, then He will just talk. That talk is answered, and there are few times where you can be lying on the bed and He comes to you. Then he speaks. So if you check the ratio of the time he speaks without an inquiry and the time he responds to inquiries, you will see he doesn't speak much, but he answers much. So the young man that is coming to showing you that he's so loving, you might just feel inside of your spirit. And you know that this is not the man. Two kids. Two kids. Was two kids. Two kids. Uh -uh. Two kids. Hello, babe. How are you? Hey, sweetheart. I'm, I'm good. Um, where, where are you right now? I'm, I'm, I'm in church office. I'm in church office right now. I'm working with pastor. Okay. Um, just, I, I just want to ask you something. Um, by any chance, do you have two kids? Sorry? Come again. By any chance, do you have two kids? Uh, so, sorry, sorry. Ooh, 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 two, two kids. I don't understand what you're talking about. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Please just calm down. That if I have two kids, what kind of a talk is that? That's embarrassing now. We, you shouldn't be saying all that. I don't mean to embarrass you, upset you or anything, but the thing is, my spirit is uneasy. I just feel... I'm not, I'm not at peace. Are you sure you don't have two kids from anywhere? Hey, if you, 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 I've told you everything about me. You shouldn't be asking all that, okay? Okay, okay. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, 
All right, take care. I, I love you. Huh? All right, bye. Take care. Yeah. Luthier, I'm so sorry. Please, please get up. I don't know why you're kneeling down. Please, just get up. No, no, no. You, you don't understand. How did you know? Wait, what is it? What's going on? How did you know? How did you know? I've not rested since you made that call. No, what? What do you mean? When you called me, you talked about two kids. Are you trying to joke with me? Is this for real? Please, just just talk to me. Talk to me. Tell me everything. Oh God, I'm scared of you. The truth was that I relocated to town. Yes. I decided to join church to look for a girl to marry. I met pastor, became pastor's main man, so seed and all. Planted myself in church that I will marry you. But the actual fact was that I'd married before in my former city. Jesus. Impregnated two girls, and I, I just wanted to start life again. Just marry somebody, and you know, without telling my story. Then all of a sudden, you called me and you said two kids. How did you know? Who told you? So you mean this is the kind of person you are? How did you know? Oh my God! Ha! So this is the secret you were keeping. You Jesus. Indeed, eh? The person that stays in God's secret place gets access to secrets. Please forgive me. Ah! Forgive me. And I loved you blindly. Forgive me. Ah, imagine if I had followed the recommendation of men, I would have been condemned. If you had blinded me with all the gifts and all the sweet words from your mouth, I would have been here now. Third wife. Please, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for deceiving you. I'm so oh, sorry. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <sighs> hey, family. Thank, thank you, you for, for watching, watching our, our video. video. Yeah, do well to subscribe on our YouTube channel, Facebook, and Instagram at The Windows. For more videos. Yeah. You want to make a donation or you want to support our ministry, the account details are on the screen. Yeah. Thank you so much. God, God bless you. you. Bye. Bye.